Before I start this video, 76% of you guys who are watching my channel are not subscribed to this channel. Please subscribe and help me grow this because I would like to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of 2022. And that is my goal for this year. So please subscribe and thank you guys for watching my channel. The Batman, directed by Matt Reeves and starring Robert Pattinson, Zoe Kravis, Jeffrey Wright, Paul Dano, and John Turturro, and is about Bruce Wayne, aka the Batman, trying to figure out the mystery that the Riddler is leaving behind before more people die. Now, I've been very excited for this movie. I read the prequel novelization, which I really never do for these types of movies, but I want to know more about this Batman before going in because the trailers left me with goosebumps. And if you guys haven't, go check out that video where I explain everything you should know before going in this Batman movie because it brightened my knowledge about this Batman and I'm sure it'll brighten your guys' knowledge too. So I recommend checking it out, but I have to say, throw Twilight into the garbage because freaking Robert Pattinson is the best Batman out there. Favorite Batman was always a tie between Christian Bale and freaking Ben Affleck because Christian Bale went for the realistic type of Batman, rich billionaire type. Ben Affleck went for a more comic booky Batman, Justice League type of and that's okay there's interpretations but my god this film at times did not feel like a batman movie it felt like its own type of thing it didn't even feel like the justice league could cross over into this universe because it's that grounded and it feels that realistic but my god this movie is amazing i got goosebumps in a lot of scenes. I haven't had goosebumps in a movie since Avengers Endgame. That's how good this movie is. From epic fight sequences between random bad guys that are really great, by the way. The fight choreography, man. Like, it's not shaky cam, it's all still cam. So it's just, you can see it, it's smooth. The freaking chase sequences in this film is so amazing man i got goosebumps from that freaking just i love this movie i really really love this movie i think about it on the way home was there anything bad about this movie no for me there wasn't it gave me everything i wanted a grounded mystery with batman and that's what it is let's talk about the suit the suit is amazing. I love the suit. It looks like something that freaking man could create. Not like, oh, it's a military Kevlar suit. It looks like someone throwing it together like Bruce Wayne would. And I like that. It's not like the Dark Knight. It's not like Ben Affleck's. It looks like a thrown together suit. And I really like that. Also, the Batmobile this film is awesome. I love the Riddler. Paul Dano is amazing. John Turturro also. He's awesome. There, I don't have any real issues with this movie. It's amazing. I love every single aspect about it. Also, I love what they did with Batman himself. Let's just set aside everything. Robert Pattinson. The reason why he makes a great Batman is that the bad guys fear him. He's like notorious. Everyone fears him. He think even the police fear him. They like don't he's a freaking horror movie villain at times. He's just walks in the room just saying nothing. He just stares. He has the Mandalorian effect down. 
He just stares. And even that much Bruce Wayne in this movie, which I'm all, all for, man. I love the character of Batman. So keep giving me Batman. And even when he's Bruce Wayne, Robert Pattinson just stares. And you know exactly how he's feeling. You know what he feels. And I love it. Uh, Catwoman also, Zoe Kravitz, is amazing. And yeah, overall, guys, the Batman is the best Batman movie out there. I always thought it was The Dark Knight, but somehow this topped The Dark Knight, taking one of my favorite stories of all time, The Long Halloween, and literally adapting this. And I love that because The Long Halloween is my personal favorite animated Batman and my favorite comics from Batman. And of how the freaking John Turturro in one of the scenes is literally quoting a scene line from line from that comics in the movie to Bruce Wayne in this movie. It's awesome. I'm like, he said it. He said the line. It's so cool. But overall, I'm giving the Batman an A+. Plus. This movie is fantastic. I, Matt Reeves, man, one of my favorite directors working today. He directed so many amazing films from Cloverfield to The Planet of the Apes. And he ever, he never misses. And he hit another home run. But that's all for this time. Punch out like button face like boss. Subscribe and see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.